I'm just going to talk to you about some suggestions for home learning in other subjects. So geography today, this is my thinking for week 14. So to start with, um, this web link will be on the suggested activities. Lots of you have seen this before. This is brilliant for you to just do 10, 15 minutes of practice testing your general knowledge, your locational knowledge of the geography of the UK. So you can click on things like mountains and rivers. Um, if you've been watching my counties videos, you can also try counties of England. And then as you get really great at the UK, you can move on to locational knowledge of Europe as well. So we're suggesting that you do um, a couple of other subject activities each day. So you do your maths, do your English. And then on top of that, this could be one of the activities one day, like I said, 10, 15 minutes. And I'd be happy with that because then you're constantly practicing your locational knowledge. I've also suggested for week 14 that you do one of the bite size, bite size suggested lessons. And again, the website details are on the suggested activities a kind of overview for the week. So this focus is about the Alps. So you get to learn about the Alps, which are a mountain range in Europe. So when you follow the link to Bite Size, you'll come to this daily lessons page and it tells you that there's one animation about the Alps, one short film showing views of the Alps, and there are two activities. So if we're thinking about your daily other subject lessons, I think this could easily be two afternoons of work because you could watch the animation and the short film and then you could do the quiz. I'll scroll down and show you in a minute. And then on a second afternoon, you could recap this again. You could watch the animation and the film again and then you could try the second activity as well. So it gives you some information, first of all. Then there's an animation to watch. I love this with Souvenir. Do you get it? It's like one of my bad jokes. So you can learn about the Alps on that animation. Then this links with your work on mountains that we did earlier in the year. Um, it talks about the weather. It talks about how the mountains were formed. It talks about tourism. Some beautiful photos here of the Alps. So obviously there's not snow all year round because the Alps have a similar climate to, to the one that we have in this country. Obviously, in the winter, they get a lot more snow, so they're popular. Alps are a popular destination for skiers. And then there's another little film there as well. So this is what I was talking about, the activity. So on the first day that you look at the geography, you could do all, read all the information, watch the animation, watch the, watch the film, and then you could just have a go at the quiz, and that would be enough. And then on a second separate day, recap the information and then maybe come back and create yourself a brochure with this suggested activity here. So as long as you've got internet and you can get onto BBC Bite Size, then these activities I think would be great for you to do in week 14.